I was really pleased with the fall, particularly the way we ended at the Big Green at Dartmouth. Um, we showed some real t uh, toughness on the court, which I really like, some intensity, some mental toughness. Uh, the freshmen stepped in and played really in a, in a strong way. Um, I, I have these two freshmen. I have Anna and I have Arzu. Arzu is one of the better players on the team for sure. Um, but I have not been really sure about how tough they would be, how they would fit in with the team. And it showed that they did very well. Um, the senior leadership has been quite strong with Yuli and Sonia and Jesse. And um, they've been really leading the way. Yeah, I think that's one of our strengths is that we're really strong for all the way down to eight. When they eight travelers, we have 11 players on the team and even the number eight can step in and, and play and do well. Um, we've proven that. And I, I'm not as concerned with managing the season through injury or um, exhaustion or whatever because Division One tennis is, it takes a lot out of you. So uh, I'm not as concerned because I know we have players that can step in and they already have. You know, I, it's really hard. I mean, it ends, this, the November ends very abruptly, and then all of a sudden I don't see them. Um, we see them in training off court and everything, but hitting the ball, we don't see them until January. It's a very, very long break. In the summertime, I know that they're home training and, and playing, but it's hard for in December. They've got a lot of schoolwork to do, and it's very tough to know if they're playing enough. Um, they have come back ready to play. I think right now we're a little, they're a little bit chomping at the bit trying to get themselves on the court and play some matches because you can only practice so much, you can only drill so much, you can only play practice matches so much. And I think they look forward to testing themselves now. This weekend, it's a little bit uh, rough for us. I think this weekend we're missing Arzu, um, who's injured and uh, she can't play. So that's going to take the stuffing out of us a little bit. But um, Brown, last year we lost the match 4-3. Um, we, that match could have gone either way. We play at Brown. Um, we play both matches away, and they're two of the better teams that we play. So it's a, it's a hard way to start. However, it's a good way to really test yourselves and, and get ourselves ready for the season. So I think they're looking forward to it. The Brown match, um, even with Arzu out, I think we have some, some strength, and we, we could do a job with them. Um, at one, I'll probably play Yuli, and at two, Sonia. Um, Brown's strength is at the top. I think if we're going to beat Brown, we'd have to beat them from, from somewhere from the middle of the lineup on down. Um, I think the kids are looking forward to the match. Um, so I'm, I'm pretty pleased at getting that one started. The Harvard match, they're, they're very, very good. They're top 60 in the country. Um, and that one's going to be a little bit rougher. Uh, there is a new format now that they're trying out for tennis. Um, I'm not quite sure if this is going to be something new. Brown has played three matches already. Um, we're untested at the moment. Um, Harvard has played a couple matches. So, it, and then we have this new format, which is um, so you play doubles is till six um, instead of the eight-game pro set. It's a six-game set. There's no warm-up now with your opponents. You warm up with your team and you walk on the court and you and you start playing right away. Um, and then after the doubles match is over, you do not walk on the court and warm up with your opponent again. You walk out and you start right away. And there's no third set. Um, fitness has always been one of our strengths, so taking out the third set, uh, we'll have to see how that affects us. Sure, I mean, I, I, I do believe that um, we want to put ourselves up against everybody that, will, that is tough. We, we want to play anybody. I don't care where they are, but we are, really want to play anybody so that when we get to the Atlantic 10 Conference, we're ready to go. We've been picked third. Um, I think that's about right right now. I think second or third is, is um, sort of where we should be picked. And then once you get to that place, then who knows? Um, our big weekend will be the George Washington Fordham weekend and because they're the teams that are picked fourth and fifth. And you know, after VCU, there's a cluster of some teams that anybody could do well. But Starting out non-conference and starting out as tough as we are, I think it, it's the way we want to be if we want to go after what we want in the end.